All right, the dreaded mulligan. This hand is not keepable. This hand would be keepable if we drew like straight lands. Uh, I don't know if that's going to happen. Oh man. All right, well, at least we have lands now. But if he has like any sort of fast start, um, it's bad news bears. All right, no two drop is good news. Not that we have anything going on. Yeah, read the bones would be amazing next turn. All right, no three drop, and I'll be a happy camper. If he just goes at like one two double strike thing, if he just like puts the enchantment on it next turn, I'm just completely hosed. Yeah, well, at least I have that. I'm I'm still probably hosed though. It doesn't appear that he has it, or he probably would just slam it. Interesting. This doesn't seem like too big of a threat to him, to be honest, but... Alright. Okay, so... I could play the Harpy. I don't think that does a whole lot for me, though. I'd rather just play a guy that can potentially block his. Um, probably not going to get a relevant card here. Because we're only seeing two. But anything to make up the card disadvantage at this point, I would be grateful for. Alright, so Threaten or Spark Jolt? I don't particularly care about Threaten right now. Because um, he doesn't have an enchantment on this. Spark Jolt could kill the Harpy. So I guess I'm taking that. And if he wants to waste his turn to threaten this thing, like, be my guess. Maybe that's a little uh, short sighted just because I don't like killing the Harpy isn't a huge deal. Um, but that Spark Jolt would also let him kill my Disciple. Which I don't really want. Maybe he's able to do that anyways. Alright, uh, that's bad. So, yeah, now I think we just need to play out some dudes. Interesting, no threaten. Okay, um, hmm. Hmm. So I could double block. He's gonna eat two things. He still has three cards in hand. One of them is threatened. I mean, he can't threaten this, so that's not super concerning for me. And if I'm going to double block, I guess it's with these two? Uh, this kind of turns that off, though, on its own. Alright, so we're going to double block like this. And hopefully it works.
And he has another one. Alright, well. Uh, now I'm going to take a hit off of it. Um, and hopefully we can use this thing to kill it next turn. Kind of all in at this point. <laughs> Since uh, he still has three cards in hand, we know one, which doesn't do much on this board. So we're taking five here. Um, pretty much regardless. Um, a really good draw would just be like a two drop. Because now he's just flooding the board, yeah. Okay, so that's that's pretty clutch for us. Um, so this will become a fourth three first strike, and he has the threaten. Okay, so yeah, I'm just gonna pass. See what he does. Alright. Yeah, that's kind of bad. It's flying in haste. Yeah. Okay. Okay, okay. So... That's fine. So... Question is here. This might be my last opportunity to eat this guy. Because I could eat this guy, and then I can just kill this next turn uh, with Lash the Whip. So I think I'm going to do that. So we're going to make this guy attack. And uh, actually, I can, eat, I can eat two of his guys. So we're going to eat this one. Might as well attack with a hound. No, actually, it doesn't matter. Because um, it's going to get shrunk. So, now I go to blocks. I want this here, and this here. And then we will shrink his attackers. And that will take four. This is kind of bad news for me, though. Especially since I sighted out my 3-4 flyer. I didn't know he had that one. Okay, Eidolon is not the worst. So, I think, um, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, five. Yeah, I don't have enough to do that. So, I think I just need to hit with the giant. I guess I'm, yeah, I'm taking two here kind of stinks, but it's the way it's got to be. Okay, so he's threatening. That's fine. Kind of glad he's using it now on this rather than something else. Because it's only going to do one point of damage to me. Ooh, that's bad news. Yeah, that's real bad. That is bad. She's going to be able to give this flying next turn. Shoot. Well, so either way, I pretty much need to top deck here, I think. 
Oh, he's not attacking. Alright, well now I have to kill this. Strange. I don't know why he didn't attack with that, but that is a small blessing. Oh. Alright, so actually no, I didn't need the top deck because I can I can give this death touch if I wanted to. Well, no, because he could he could pump that up, so I just have to kill it. Kill it, kill it, kill it. Alright, we need to finish him off, so hopefully he doesn't have a creature that can deal seven damage. He probably doesn't. See, this is five. So wait, let's let's do the math here. Four, four, four is yeah. So I need to attack with this once, but I can probably do that later. So I'll leave it back for now, just in case, in case he gets some like huge hasty creature. <laughs> really, jeez. Oh, all right. Huh. So two creatures. Okay. That was a pretty good draw. Um, I don't think we have the mana to cast it. We do have the mana to play idle on though. Um, yeah, and I don't. Let's see. This I can make this a one-one. So I can eat something with this. Um, I think. So I can attack with the giant. But how if he's just chumping like that's that is money. Um, so the question here, I guess I could just bestow this. Um, yeah, might as well. Um, and I'm going to be able to drain him for four. Um, so, yeah, potentially he's just dead, depending on how he plays this. It's a very close game, though. Flying double strike. All right. You. All right. Well, I guess now he's not just dead. Why did he... This is an instant. He should have... Um, I guess he was scrying for something else. Put it on top. All right. Well, I have to block. I, no, I think I still got him because now he's tapped down. Uh, let's see, four, five, right? Uh, let's do the math. So this comes down. He's draining for three. Four, five, eight. Not quite enough. Um, so I can. I have a couple options. I can play the Nimbus, or I can bestow. Actually, I can bestow this to give it flying, and then that'll chump it another turn. Or I can just try to drain him to gain more life. You put the card on top. All right. So I think I'm just going. Since I can't kill him this turn, I think it gives me the best bet if I just bestow onto my Eidolon. What is this? Are you kidding? All right, uh, I'm still not dead though.
That's a pretty good draw. Um, so he can he can't attack in profitably here. Okay, so I think yeah, if I if I attack with both, he has to block each one, or he's just dead because I'm going to be draining him for life afterwards. Um, so I'm definitely swinging in with both. And I mean, he has to trump both, anyways. Guess he can trump like that. It's still. Oh, all right. So he's just dead. That's fine. All right. That was a very close game. On to the finals.